When it comes to what women find attractive in men, you probably think they just focus on your height or the size of your muscles. However, while there is some truth in that, women actually notice far more the finer detail that most men overlook. So today, I'm gonna show you the eight most important things women notice first in men. And then, I'm gonna show you how to improve them. Number one, your immune system. Women will look at your immune system and decide if they wanna mate with you. In science, they call this immunocompetence, which states that certain traits in men, like a narrow waist compared to the size of their chest, can demonstrate the competence of their immune system, which is an indicator of how healthy and strong they are. That's because these traits usually develop because of hormones like testosterone. Therefore, by increasing your waist to chest ratio, you will show women you have high levels of testosterone and therefore a strong immune system. So here's how you're gonna increase that waist to chest ratio within minutes with the military tuck. First, I want you to tuck in your dress shirt into your trousers like you normally would. Then any extra fabric that's on either side, you will fold it back towards your hips. Finally, you will smooth out the shirt in the front so it looks flat and neat. What you just did is remove any extra fabric from the sides of your shirt, giving you an instant tailored look that makes your chest look wider than your waist. And like I promised you, you just optimized a small detail that most men overlook, but women will notice. I got seven more of these, which takes me to number two. She notices the background on your profile picture. Most men destroy their attraction when uploading pictures on their Tinder profile. And it's not even because of how you look. You see, most guys will think, oh, I'm just gonna take a picture of myself and try to look as good as possible. But they're thinking about it all wrong. You forgot the background. During a study that used eye tracking to see what both men and women looked at first when it came to a dating profile, what researchers found was that the biggest thing that women look at first was the background. They concluded that the reason that women first looked at the background is because they were looking for signs of wealth and resources, a trait that all women find highly attractive in men. So instead of uploading a picture of yourself that's a selfie in your bathroom or a selfie in your car, here's what you're gonna do instead. First, I want you to dress nice. A nice button down, some nice slacks, you're gonna put some jewelry on, a necklace, a watch if you have one, and then you're gonna go out with your boys. You're gonna go out to a high quality rooftop bar. You get extra points if it has a view. Then you're gonna take some high quality pictures of yourself with an iPhone. You're gonna use your boys to help you. Want some with the boys, some just by yourself. So that next time that you create your profile, the first thing women will see is a man of high status, of a high social circle, and therefore high net worth. Three, the size of your noodle. You heard me right. When meeting for the first time, one of the first things women will notice is the size of your noodle. Bro, Campbell, I cannot believe you were thinking, I'm talking about your neck, bro, come on. That's what, that's what I'm talking about. Here. And look, don't take my word for it. I know you're probably thinking the other thing, but the neck is the most important visible trait on your body. And according to a survey of 423 women, when they were shown a thin and athletic and a thick neck, women found the athletic neck to be extremely attractive. So here's an easy routine to improve the appearance of your neck that I've been implementing every day. First, you're gonna lay down on a bench. Then grab yourself a very light plate anywhere from five to 10 pounds. Lightly place that plate on your forehead. Use your hands to keep it steady and hold it in place. Then you will perform neck curls, curling your head down and up, and try to go for 20 repetitions, doing three sets total. Four, she'll notice the symmetry of your face. Men with very symmetrical faces are seen as more attractive, dominant, and tend to have more sexual partners. Now. Here is the advantage we have over women. Unlike women, men can actually change the shape of their face. See, facial symmetry is simple. It just means that both sides of your face are very similar. In other words, if you draw an imaginary line down the middle of your face, it would almost match perfectly. Now, everybody has asymmetrical features, including myself. So here's how you're gonna change the shape of your face to make it look more symmetrical. First, you're gonna choose a beard style that suits your natural face shape, for example, if you have a circular face, longer beards tend to look better as it'll give you more length. If you have more of an angular face, you will want to keep your beard tighter as it's gonna show off those sharp features. Then, you will want to use a beard roller. It doesn't matter at what stage of a beard you have, every guy should be using one to make their beard look thicker. The one I have is from a company called Copenhagen Grooming. 
The way you should think about it is that the thicker your beard is, the more control you'll have to be able to reshape your facial structure. Number five, being mature at an early age. According to evolutionary biology, you acting more mature than your peers is extremely attractive to women as they typically prefer to date older men. This is considered paedomorphism when a man reaches maturity at an earlier stage than their peers. Now, the fastest and easiest way to increase this paedomorphism isn't by completely changing your behavior. It's simply growing facial hair. However, for most of you, this might not be always as easy. It doesn't come natural to you. So you start using natural supplements. For example, Arginine. This is a natural and an essential amino acid that has been proven to help with the growth and thickness of hair. I apply this to my face daily through my beard activator serum that I got from Copenhagen Grooming. As a matter of fact, I've been doing this consistently for the last three weeks as I am running a $10,000 giveaway with you guys, my community, because I truly want to encourage you to grow a beard. I want to show you what can actually happen when you're a little disciplined. You take my advice and see how you drastically change your attractiveness. And yes, one of you will take $10,000 home. As a matter of fact, any of you that join this progress with me, check out Copenhagen Grooming. You guys can click the link down below. You will get an entire beard growth kit that comes with the activator, a derma roller, and a cleaner. You can use this daily, and within five months, you will grow a beard. And whoever has the nicest transformation, I'm gonna give you $10,000. If you guys wanna join, I'm gonna have the link down below. And for those that don't win, you'll still win in life you'll look more attractive and you'll look more mature, which is something that she's gonna notice. Now, let's look at it from the woman's perspective. The first thing she'll notice is your chest to waist ratio to see how healthy your genes are. If it's online, she'll take a look at your background first to look for signs of wealth. She'll look for men with athletic necks. She wants men that has symmetrical faces because they're more dominant. And more importantly, she's looking for men that are more mature than she is. You now have the competitive edge where you now truly understand what women notice first, but there are three last things that most guys overlook. Number six, women that are around you. You have to understand, men are seen as more attractive when there are other women around them. The reason for this effect is called mate choice copying. Now, the problem for most men is that they can't even get one girl, so how are you gonna get multiple girls to come with you? It makes no sense, but here's how you do it. During a study, that was published in the Journal of Scientific Research. 49 women were shown pictures of men along various pieces of artwork and then asked to rate those men on a scale of one to 10 when it came to attractiveness. Then, women were shown what other women rated the same men. And then they were asked if they would like to change the rating. In almost every situation, the woman either rated the man higher or lower depending on what other women rated him. So, here are some ways to use mate choice copying to enhance your appearance. When you're going to a group setting and there's a girl that you like there, offer to pick up every friend of yours that you have that's a girl. And if you don't have any, take a cousin or a sister. That way when you arrive, those female friends' presence will convey to other women around them that you are a high quality man that can be trusted. Number seven, the tone of your skin. The color of your skin is one of the first things that women will notice. In a study, researchers found that medium tan skin tones with the natural complexion are most attractive and indicate higher levels of testosterone. So here's a simple hack to instantly give you that tan skin tone color and improve your complexion. I want you to buy tinted sunscreen. This was a game changer for me. I've always worn sunscreen, but I hated that white film look that you get because most sunscreen is white. And especially as a darker skin tone guy, it was horrible. So when I ran into this, it changed the game. So this, is a regular sunscreen, but it comes in the same color of, as your skin. So now when you apply it, not only does it blend perfectly, it also hides imperfections. It protects your skin from the sun and it gives you that nice glow and bright complexion that she will notice immediately. Number eight, the version of the phone you have. You might not realize it, but the phone that you're using right now will directly influence how women perceive you. You see, during a recent study with a thousand people, they were shown various images of people holding different phones before they developed their opinions. During that survey, more than 60% of women admitted of judging a man based on the phone the man was holding, as well as its model and condition. It gets even more interesting because 55% of women admitted 
they thought negatively of a man that had a broken phone. And 35% say they considered a man poor if their phone was old. In other words, don't be me. Yo, like, I, I, I kid you not, I cracked my phone the other day. Like, yo, this is, this is ghetto, bro. But the point is, don't be this guy. Well, I'm already married. I'm out the game, bro. I won the game already. I need you to stay focused. Your head's still in the game. And the weight and the phone that you have matters. Whether you like it or not, whether you think it's unfair, you need to make sure your phone can be cracked. Your phone should be a decent model. And look, you don't have to buy a brand new one. Buy it used, buy it refurbished. Those phones can be 50, 60% cheaper than buying it brand new. You get the same effect, something that she's gonna notice. And it's gonna put you above other men. You use this alongside everything else I just told you. You will capture any woman's attention because most men overlook these details. If you guys wanna continue to level up, I'll leave you two more videos here.